I'm excited to talk to you today about Nazarene Compassion Ministries. This is a wonderful area in our church that supports pastors and leadership development, disaster response, refugee response. It goes on and on. It helps build wells. Today we'd like to talk about child sponsorship. Child sponsorship has been going really well in our church. We have got six children that we'll share about in a minute, and they are doing really well. We're encouraging you as an individual to sponsor a child yourself. Seven million children are going to be and have been already affected by severe hunger this year. If we could help with more children being sponsored and more food into their little tummies, that would be so wonderful. With the Nazarene Compassion Ministries Child Sponsorship, these children have health checks, they have uh, nutritious meals, they go to school, they have supplies, um, school supplies. It's a wonderful, well-rounded program. If you can help with that, it's $30 a month, which is $1 a day. If you could help out with that, that would be wonderful. If you find that that is difficult, maybe get your cell group or your Bible study. Really encourage them. Maybe as a group you could do that. That would be just wonderful. And you, your group would have a child, and even that would be more uh, children helped. Anne Pohl is the one that has the... Um, correspondence with these children and she's given me a little update that I would like to share with you about our children. Corlas is a chap from Jordan. He is eight years old and he has one sibling and he loves to be at home and he likes washing dishes so his mother sure probably enjoys having him around. In his free time he enjoys playing soccer and likes to read the Bible. David is a nine-year-old from Armenia. He is in grade three and has one other sibling. He enjoys soccer and at church he enjoys the kids club. Yarmly is an 11-year-old girl. She's from the Dominican and has five siblings and she's in grade six and feels very privileged to be able to go to school and have her supplies for her so she uh, can get a good education. She likes to play with her dolls, and at church she enjoys Sunday school. Rubli is 10 years old, and she is from India. She helps her mom around the house. She enjoys going to Sunday school at church also, and she likes to play with her friends. Mansur is a child, and he's seven, and he's from Bangladesh. His father is a farmer, and his mother is a housewife. He likes to help his sister and enjoys playing the local games. Lastly is Ravi. She is a 16-year-old girl from Sri Lanka. She has been sponsored since 2013 and she's in grade 11. She has one sibling. She likes to help her mother at home and she also enjoys running. And we pray for her as she comes to the end of her school year and then goes into grade 12 and then finishes. We have uh, uploaded a DVD and on our website here, and that's a wonderful DVD about child sponsorship and their stories, testimonials of young people that have uh, come through the child sponsorship program and have been able to have um, started into wonderful careers in their own lives and have been pulled out and helped out of poverty. So. Let's do that more so this year is, is helping others that have nothing and giving them some hope for the future. This Christmas time, pick up your Bible. Go to the Luke, the, the, the story, the Christmas story, and read through it. And just pray and let God put his hope and his joy into your life so that you can share with those around you in your daily walk in this world. God bless each of you today.